But after two or three years, you know, you just start complaining on unnecessary things. Why is that brush there? The brush shouldn't be there, it should be here. Then the argument becomes just escalate into something else and you know. So yeah, communication. It's happy once again. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Meet my friend Toby, Toby Vincent. Yep. So today we're talking about chemistry in a relationship. Um what's the share thoughts? So what do you think about chemistry in a relationship? Well, chemistry relationship is very important like it's very extremely very important but at the same time too without a good foundation we can have good chemistry which means we can have good connection good bonding and what's the foundation the foundation is communication you know um, um these days unfortunately lovers and partners are not friends because Because the foundation is bad in the sense that um, they can't sit down and talk about things mm -hmm. about you know how was your day did they, did did they, did did men look at you like they like these days lovers don't most lovers don't joke they're not the communication there is not strong so if the communication if the communication is not strong. If there is misunderstanding, they find it very difficult to sit down and talk it out. Okay, so I want to even stop you there. So in my condition, this condition is not strong, right? What do you mm. think is the reason for that? Because I, I assume that before the relationship, mm. they communicated. So, how come they well, talk communication? The, 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 the talk doesn't mean... You know, when you say communication, it means... That's just like he's saying before going into marriage, people cut. Mm -hmm. That's how, you know, and they believe courtship is the foundation before getting into marriage because it's a lifetime, long term thing. So, communication in the sense that getting to know each other, getting to know what drives you, know your strength, know your weakness know where you're coming from, know where you're going to, like friends, you know, like, you know, back then in high school and where you could just talk about this, talk about that, you know, if, if they say, oh, this is your friend did this, you can back, you know, ease or, or like, nah, no, that's not the person I know, mm. like, like, cliche and mm. stuff like that, so, but, these days, it's just unfortunate that the most of the attraction between two people are just physical. You know, it's just physical. F forgetting that all this someday will shrink. Mm -hmm. You know, the the jaw that is standing will drop. You know, you know, the boobs that is upright will the will, will yeah, be like it will, yeah, You understand? So, but. One thing that has to keep the train moving is the mind, you know. Are you able to sit down and talk? That's the thing that keeps, you know, people that are married for 42 years, 50 years keep going because all this is gone. But this will always stay. That's how I always tell people that I'm not into the whole fine boy thing because I have something that's stronger that can speak loud than my looks which is my craft and what i do but because i understand that all this would still would never be the same so if the chemistry is good between two lovers or friends means they've been through thick and thin and because if you don't fall you will understand how to crawl before standing tall you know so chemistry is also has to do with how you're able to deal with your turbulence and not um, co part ways, you know, the strength. It just, it just, it just, it just shows how strong 
you can stay if you know if adversity is hitting your level yeah so at the end of the day everything is still still bodies down to the foundation which is good communication platform communication can take on chemistry, chemistry, chemistry okay now i know some people see chemistry as just like you said earlier mm. people see chemistry as something physical um do you think that's a wrong mindset or do you think the physical is also very important when it comes to chemistry like attraction attraction is one thing vibing is another thing you can you can see someone who's good looking who is sexy who is beautiful by the time he or she start dropping words from a mouth or from his mouth you just understand now nah. and you can the only way you can know that is when you know what you want you know your worth you know your purpose you have standard then you know you know the difference between what you need from what you want like yeah like m real matured women they need love making than one sex you know because it goes beyond just satisfying the sexual urge you know and without good chemistry you can make love then why do you marry person in the first place because it's a fatuation because of that you know this the back to what we were saying earlier on about the responsibility of this the men of this generation mm. you know they're not resp they don't want to be responsible for anything and to make it worse dating apps has made it not very million, convenient very convenient <laughs> like mm. if this is not working swipe yes. left swipe you know yes. you swipe oh okay she looks you know but well, that's the world we live in so what can you do you just have to know your standard mm -hmm. know your worth you know if you see what's going to waste your time mm -hmm. don't even indulge in it you know yeah you could go you know you could go out on dates and you know the first five to ten minutes it's not your thing you would know just don't bother you would even know nah, don't bother because no woman want to be with boys and no man a few good girls. men too don't want to deal with girls because it's a whole lot of stress Aye. you know it's a whole lot of stress especially when you're in diaspora when you're abroad you've got bills to pay you've got work you've got school you don't start wasting your time with Kindergarten kind of person. Mm, kindergarten. Hello. Sure. <laughs> your time. Okay, okay. I yeah, I I, I love your um opinion on this particular topic. I think we should just stop here. I want to make a ten minutes video. Um yeah, but seriously, I appreciate your presence on my YouTube um, video. Thanks, 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 guys for watching. If you have any questions, what do you think? Do you think chemistry is important in a relationship, and what do you even define as chemistry? Like and like you said, do you think communication is the most important thing in keeping a relationship or making a relationship strong? Um, so drop your comments, like, share, and. Kind of please subscribe to Abby's Coolness channel and put uh, put uh, subscribe, subscribe and like and thumb button. Pushing my journey.